Today's Wednesday, the 21st of June, 2017, and you're watching Dallas Vintage Toys Talks, the number one rated Wednesday AM talk show about toys. Uh, today we've got another... First day of summer. Mm. Is it really? Wow. It's and I'm wearing a hoodie. It's hot, yeah. hot, hot. <laughs> uh, but uh, we got a full house today. Uh, you got the five dudes in front of you, and then we got a live studio audience. Let's hear from them. <laughs> Yay! 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 Yeah. 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 yeah, toys. <laughs> but uh, my name is Andy. Um, we didn't change it since last week. Um, to my left is uh, tattoo artist extraordinaire Rob right. Mendez. To his Kat left Bondi. is <laughs> Sean <laughs> Von Rob. <laughs> the uh, jazz hands man. If anyone else does jazz hands, they're copying Sean. Uh, <laughs> and then to his left is Ryan Wilhelm. And to his left, the is, <laughs> directly in front of me, He's is like, Mexico's oh, greatest <laughs> export, Henry Velasquez, El Mafra. Thank you all for uh, your support. I'm going to say who's behind the camera? Behind the camera, we, we've got uh, the newest addition to yeah. Dallas Finished Toys and Trevor. Uh, what? Hi, how's it going? Trevor got hired? Trevor! Jeez! Soon to be hired. Oh, welcome. Whoa. Soon to be hired. I didn't know. Soon. 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 Next to him is Dallas Finished Toys' number one fan, Fidel Morello. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, baby. New, yeah. new, new employee, yeah, March yeah, 2018. Behind the camera <laughs> is uh, the coolest guy I know, um, Jared Gwimes. Oh, wow. Thank yeah, you. big praise. So kind. He and loved Transformers. It was great. <laughs> That's a lie. And also, we're joined by Jessica. How are, are all the people behind the camera doing today? DVT. 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 <laughs> it's an adequate response. It's full, of, full of energy, right? <laughs> but, uh,. So, as always, we've got a table full of toys here because at Dallas Vintage Toys, we've got a constant influx of new toys, vintage toys, used toys, and all kinds of just really awesome stuff walking through the door. Um, we're going to talk about some toys today. Uh, Mr. Velasquez, would you like to start this week? Uh, yeah. Yes, yes, I would. Trial and error. Yes. That's our tag team name. No, that's pretty good. Oh, starting yeah. Yeah. He's, 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 he's error. error. I'm a trial. I'm error. He's sure trial. <laughs> Test, yeah. test us. Randy. <laughs> Randy. <laughs> hey, it's I'm time to get good. Randy. Yeah. Yeah. Randy up in here. Fidel's our man. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm man. just the hype man. That's a part of the one of the all white suits. That's a part of the yeah, yeah, thing. I got to throw his pocket scene in the opponent's face. Yes. We got lots of G.I. Joe. We got lots of G.I. Joe over here. I got the fever since I saw what the announcer for Comic Con. Yeah. Um, saying, this that? ain't no Mickey Mouse um, Cobra Commander, but I, I'm going to try to save up and get the base. When it comes I'm, I, I have no idea what you're talking about. Wait, what are you talking about? That sounds sweet. What are they doing What's it called? The Missile Command Center? Missile Command Center, Missile Missile Command Center was announced at Comic-Con, and it's going to oh, be a wow. nice and cardboard. And there's a guy oh, that... Oh, I'm sick. excited about it. I think I saw an image of that, but I just assumed yes, it was... There's a guy that had a website, and he was making like custom That's, ones. Mm -hmm. and then yeah. I think I signed up for it like five years ago, his wait list, and then... He just sent me an email saying, like, oh, hey, it's available. By the way, <laughs> that's cool. Like that. Chris is like, oh, yeah, Hasbro's also doing it, so yeah. that's so probably why he's jumping the gun. Would group. it work with, like, my yes. Sergeant Savage 5-inch yeah. ones? Dang, that's it's, cool. it, it looks just like the actual, like, the real deal. That's cool. It would yeah, work with cool. this bog yeah. one. Anything. So, yeah, I'm, I'm excited <laughs> about know, it, man. And it comes, yeah. like, they actually put the little Mickey Mouse here on the Cobra Commander chest. Yeah. He'll come with two other little goons. That's rad. It's awesome, man, to buy that and then get the extreme sets, um, like the little Cobra base, like would be amazing. Um, we brought so. up Comic Con exclusives, mm -hmm. so uh, I think we got to talk about that uh, NECA Comic Con turtle set. The fact oh. that it sold out in three minutes yesterday. Yes, that's insane. There were people that's that so were cool. saying it was in their cart. They were filling it out, and by the time they got to the next page, it was, it was like an instant yeah. sellout. Yeah, people everyone, were everyone calling. Who I've talked to who got it so it said they put the listing up like five minutes early, mm -hmm. and they had they were already logged into everything, so they just had to click. Yeah, basically. Yeah, and that's how they got it. And that's uh, how it should be. It's how it should be available for a couple of weeks. It's, it's going to be today, it's tomorrow, it's tomorrow, 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 tomorrow. Yeah, you got eleven o'clock today. Tomorrow. You get, a.m. You got to get on. You just got to like be refreshing. Oh, and yesterday they said it was supposed to be at one o'clock that they were doing well, it. Well, Eastern time. It jumped. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so. Yeah, I was got to look at the ES. We had people calling us. Asking when NECA is going to put it online, and I was like, "We're not NECA." <laughs> no, I'm sorry, but uh, that's pretty crazy. I mean, yeah, I can't man. think of anything that's at least anything modern. 
it's eBay has it for $500. Dollars. Of course they do. Yeah, that, that was fast. <laughs> But uh, just one thing before Henry continues, I yeah. want to remind everyone watching at home that they can interact with us at any time. Uh, and also, I'm interested to hear our fans' opinions on San Diego Comic Con exclusives. Are there ones you're looking forward to? Personally, I think that Dutch is pretty awesome. It, oh, yeah. dude. It looks like with a, a little cardboard arm. Yeah. yeah. Margarita yeah. It, almost, it almost looks like yeah. a NECA version of uh, Arnold from Almost Heroes. Or not Almost Heroes, um, Last Action Hero. Kindergarten yeah. Cop? Both of those are accurate. Apollo Creed, like doing the handshake with them. Yeah, that would have been awesome. Oh, like, just man. Having, having a they just did the. Like, exploding. Well, I think the arms gonna come over <laughs> the predators. <laughs> that would be awesome. It's a build a figure. Yeah, I just build build the arm of Arnold. That'd be awesome. What's his name in the movie? Uh, Dylan. Uh, Dylan. It should make yeah. an over right, the top. Dylan, over yeah. Oh yeah, <laughs> all greasy and all. Dylan, you so so. That's sweet. Um, but, uh, yeah, Henry, uh, kids yeah. Me, please. So, yeah, we had very impressive collections come in all week. Um, this is one of the items that came in Sunday. Um, the man Ryan got to ogle, and that stuff was great. Uh, they also brought in the Black Widow from 3A and a few other things. Um, but, yeah, this is kind of like the Saint Seiya figures where it's the body, and then you start attaching the, the armor to it. Uh, but it forms uh, the robot from Evangelion. Pretty cool. So, pretty sweet. I've never actually sat down and watched that anime. I haven't either. I can't find it. I was looking for it last night, and I couldn't find it anywhere. I think it's on the just, dark web. There's yeah, 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 yeah. It's dark we're not, I'm gonna have to go so rogue on my talent. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> crying. That's, uh, that's what that's what you want in uh, a giant robot fighting show. Crying. Yes. My tears will defeat you. Oh. I'm <laughs> rusting. It's, an, it's yeah. anime. Yeah. Anything goes in anime. <laughs> um, I forget what day this came in, but I was really excited to see it. And now I just gotta wait for the other three sets to come in because mm -hmm. I might pick this up. Uh, oh, the GI Joe Transformers crossover. Yeah, there's four now. Okay. There's four now, and then there's a bunch of little ones. One comes with Old Snake. Um, but yeah, this one and the Jetfire one are my yeah, favorites. The Jetfire one's, one's my favorite by far. Even the you box get two art on that is awesome. Yes, but uh, yeah, this one's really sweet, man, because it yeah, comes with yeah, that. And the box art's based off the comics, right? Mm -hmm. Too the Marvel ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's awesome. But now what makes this one really unique is the bat. Because he's colored like a uh, Devastator. Oh. And then okay. you get the little sound wave and the little cassettes that you oh, can't, yeah, cause you can't put the cassettes a, in there, but it's still really sweet. Yeah. And you get all the money. Destro has a briefcase of money that can actually fall apart. Mm -hmm. And a fancy that, car. That is actual cash. <laughs> it's a reimbursement for buying the toy. And we also got in the Hot Toys it's a Yoda. Build a dollar. It's an awesome figure. What Hot Toys got? Yoda, really sweet. Can't wait to have this on display and open it up because we aren't a not to touch the hot toys because they usually just fly off the shelf or mm -hmm. they got to be sealed in brand new condition. You were touching them? No. <laughs> saying we don't. Good answer. Saying we weren't allowed to. Get the square ball. You pass. <laughs> Trial and error succeeds. <laughs> <laughs> um, we also got in the Snowtrooper yeah. from Battlefront. <laughs> zap it. Um, it comes with a jetpack from, from the video game, but it's uh, it's basically Empire Strikes Back with the jetpack. So Pretty that one's really sweet. Movie uh, accurate. Yeah, yeah. So, um, the, this toy comes with quite a bit. The Yoda uh, comes mm -hmm. with quite a bit, doesn't it? That's I not believe really so. I would have a sweet display stand with like okay. this tree set up, like when he's in um, training mode with Luke and can like the cover these planning? rocks. Oh, that's what I got the little backpack, but you can't <coughs> No backpack. What? But everything else. That would have I mean, been the perfect chance. Maybe that'll go with alternate Luke. head and hands so he can like levitate the rocks. It's pretty sweet. So is there a <laughs> levitation effect? For yeah, the it rock? comes with these that's two cool. clear poles. <laughs> it comes with the force. It's it comes with it's in the empty clear tray. It's a little Ziploc bag. You got and it's like. Medical. Yeah, it, it looks great out of the box, man. It was That's a really dirty impressive word, piece. Sure. Sure. Medical Have you guys seen that, uh, that bad lip reading of the Yoda deal? Yeah. yeah I awesome. personally don't like it. I love it, man. That thing is the funniest. It's so catchy. Ever to me. Like I can't. Like, we'll listen to it, or it'll just pop in my head. I'm like, run, 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 and jump. Well, yeah, man, that's, <laughs> that's an earworm if you've ever like had it. Then the best part is you go to Alamo Draft House and they're uh, they'll play it like when we went to go see Rogue One in December. They have a whole pre-show for thirty minutes that they'll play before the movie starts mm -hmm. and they play that. Yes. And so they they're really good. Uh, the marketing teams there are really good at picking out really hilarious uh, yeah. web yeah. clips sure. and putting them together. And they, they have like you should always get to Alamo Draft House like thirty minutes early. Yeah, I they agree. put together all kinds of special. Special stuff. Plus the food's good. Yeah, I love, I love the little specialty menus and things like that. Mm -hmm. It's just that's an awesome. Well, it's all about the film experience. Yeah. 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 I agree. Cool, man. Let's talk about Ryan's toys. I just put this up on the shelf or the table rather. Um, I'm getting back into Masters of the Universe. 
both vintage and classics. Shout out to John. Um, and this is Skeletor with a uh, Panther. Nice. It's, it's a, kitty cat. Yeah, it's, it's his power cat, you know. <laughs> Skeletor is probably one of my favorite villains, even though he's never really successful. Yeah. I just think he's, there's something cool about him. It's a high power, right? Wow. My, uh, my uh, little sister messaged me uh, on Facebook, and she just said, how does Skeletor see? And I was just like, I have no idea. It's a valid question. Magic. Magic. Yeah. Magic. Good question, man. <laughs> and it's He-Man's fault. He-Man! <laughs> Let's talk about, talk about some of the ones you bought. <laughs> Same way. Let's talk yeah. about some of the ones you bought, like that Wondar. Yeah, so I'm picking up a Wondar, Thunder Punch, He-Man. Um, trying to build up the Snake Man yes. collection. Um, I got a graded Scare Glow. Yeah, dude. Ryan's awesome. collection is getting really impressive. Um, just... It's a lot that he picked it's up that are really time. noteworthy. It's about time, yeah. <laughs> Working at DVD. Hey, the Godzilla ones were always really cool. Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing both Godzilla and He Man now. Then so you're looking at a Battle Axe? Yeah, you know. <laughs> one by one, I'll add all of it. Do yeah. your yeah. time with Star Wars now. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's one of the. Uh, you know, it, it, working here is great, uh, but one of the curses of working here is. You want everything. Nine out of ten days you leave having There's bought always a toy. something. Yeah. yeah. Like, I came in like, yesterday and, like, there's like five things and I was just like oh, I want that oh I want that I want that you know and I was like adding them up I was like I don't want to drop $500 right. I'll today. trade everything <laughs> yeah <laughs> before we move on to Sean's toys I want to bring up the fact that um, Mattel's never made a Warlord figure they've got the He-Man license and they could have just made one like they did in the vintage style like the one we had <coughs> up there um, you know what I'm talking about right Rob yeah yeah you'd think they would have made one like that since it's the same sculpt and everything. Could you just have a different head. Yeah. Why have they not made a warlord? Super Seven, get on it. Why haven't they made a warlord? I don't know. So, Hasbro just killed GI answers? Joe line, so no, it didn't. They rejuvenated. It just took a break. <coughs> That's it needed, what Chris it told me. He said they axed it. Oh, wait, it's that gone after this it. year. Well, is it really? Yeah. Breaking Guess who's not back into Joe's? Yeah. <laughs> Joe is dead. Yo, no. Yeah. They say that every year. No, this. They said oh. that Mattel website was going offline. They brought back a Mattel like, Maddie collector. What is it called? I don't think, it's Ma- like, I don't it's think like Mattel Virginia. knows what they're doing. No, it's, it's like, called like uh, Maddie United or something. They're trying to look at their He-Man uh, records, uh, and then they're like, "I don't know where Wonder Bread and He-Man came from." And Wonder Bread's like, "We never made a figure." And the, then they're like, "Uh." <laughs> well, they, they, they relaunched another Mattel website, which is basically there's two Maddie. Mattels. No, no, M A T E L. <laughs> no, like it's basically Maddie Collector, but they brought it back, so there was no point in them. Is it digital? Or, I forgot the other website that's doing it now. Digital, yeah. I think. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought it was. Um, but yeah, let's talk about your Boglins. Here, yeah. Yeah. Right. Here we have a Everyone's Valkyrie. Everyone's on Boglins online. And uh, so we great. got in a bunch of good icons. And yeah. so What's this, the deal with that Valkyrie, bro? I box art. came in yesterday. The guy, these are all his childhood toys. He used to live in San Francisco. Uh, first he said he drove in from Houston, then I was like... These are childhood toys. It's kind of weird that they made it all the way to Texas because usually it just kind of stops at California and barely trickles through. But yeah, these are all his toys from childhood. A lot of uh, cool figures. He said he watched the cartoons and his dad would always pick them up on his travels. So I was like, so was your dad more of a fan or did you play with these? Because a lot of them are in really good condition. A lot of the accessories are still sealed. Uh, decals are unapplied. Yeah, just, I mean, well, this you check us out on Facebook or it was website, a massive collection. tons of them. Yeah, yeah those are like good I had all of them. I mean, did any come in with that guy yesterday other than that? Uh, yeah, that might right? be, there's a few, um, uh, like Shogun Warrior type figures, but that might be the only Valkyrie. Yeah, I think it was. Okay. Um, but really impressive stuff. Like typically when these come in, they're always missing parts or missing yeah. the majority of their parts. They're in beat up shape because mm-hmm. kids played with them. Look at that these look though. like yeah, oh, occasionally. Occasionally we'll get people thing. like this. Beautiful. There was a gentleman what a year or two ago that came in with Transformers that said that like he, he brought in like the Jetfire and a few other things. I don't know if you remember, but they were like looks as if he took them out of the box, looked at them, and then put them back in, and just that was his childhood. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you, you, no, you were all thumbs up for it when he brought so. it in to sell it. No, I mean, like, he opens <laughs> up the toy and he's like, <laughs> thumbs up. You go back. You go back Let's hype these up, man. Well, let's hype these really gets up. excited, I'm buying the Valkyrie. Okay. Dang. Let's hype, let's hype up the two packs, man. Come on. I was going to say, so well, from the box art so the Boglins. These Boglins came he wouldn't let me. He wouldn't let me touch them. And these boxes are in such amazing condition. I thought that they repopped them. I had to look at them close because 
Usually the they don't come box. in with the boxes and they just come in with like a little rubbery boggling figure. It's got like hair and dirt <laughs> and dust all stuck to it. I, can't I, 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 I thought those were like adult uh, reissues or something. Nope. These are the, the original. That looks brand new. It's I know. Original, dude. It's crazy. That's awesome. This was actually straight till I pulled it up. What box. year? What year are the Boglins from? <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to look that up. Eighty nine. No, older. You gotta be kidding me. Eighty six. Earlier than that. Nineteen eighty seven. Eighty seven. Wow, thirty years. I failed twice. It kind of reminds me of the Critters movie. <laughs> the I may get one of those today. Right over there. I failed twice. That's sick. <laughs> those could be graded. And I, I was actually loose, at man. the old location. <laughs> well, I don't know if there was ever boggling? tape still there. That's or not. our tactic. Yeah, you <laughs> can't. <laughs> the graded, the graded bog ones. If you have a sealed boggling, send us a picture. Okay. The yeah. goblin drink. Or send it to the us. We'll pay. we'll pay. Dude, I have a loose dollar. one I got from y'all. That's and like you said, it's covered in hair. Disgusting, but it's so much fun, man. Hey, and like, don't. Hey, boy. He won't let me play with it. But man, that box. It puts the toy at a whole other level, man. That's insane, dude. The box is really, really Sean, I called dibs on that one. <laughs> Sean, I think Sean wants to sell it. We're calling dibs it. Sound like he really wants <laughs> yeah, like these. these. <laughs> Man, those are nice. This is incredibly. Rough. Henry's like, let's He's put it on the here. website, and I was like, uh, and there's gonna be packing peanuts like in I'd there. I'd rather not. Bro. <laughs> I'm not gonna open it like Henry. Rob opens it up. I was just trying to set the little guy free. That's sick. That is pretty cool. It is so awesome with the holes in the box on the top and everything. With the and the, the, the do the not vent, feed. the vent bars like it's trying to escape. Yeah. Extremely so cool. rare That's creature. Insane. Then we got a bunch of the G.I. Joes that are still in my office. Uh, here's some of the Night Force ones. Uh, Psych Out and Tunnel Rat. Beautiful. Toys R Us exclusive. Beautiful. Yeah. Was Night Force Sears or Toys R Us? Toys R Us. Okay. And what was Tiger? In... Tiger Squad was? Tiger Force. Tiger Force was, was exclusive to him. It might have been Target. I'm not was it Target? sure. It was Target. It was Target of Camel, I think. And sneak peek and Falcon. Wow. And we just got an email. He's going to send us the 1989 wave as well. So probably going to ship that to us before July 4th. Sweet. Because we buy toys. So what does this mean? Joe's awesome. being done. What hmm? you saying earlier? Hasbro's done with making Joe. Hey, just rumors. My buddy Chris that goes to all the Joe cons and everything. He texted me after he bought a bunch of Joes from us that one day, and he's like, Hasbro canceled GI Joes. Delete, delete. They say that every year. Oh. And then they came out with all those two packs, and then they were exclusive Toys R Us. It's awesome. They, they ask- need to, to launch G.I. Joe Black Series or something like yeah, that. Equivalent. That's six, yeah. Yeah. Six, they need to bring G.I. back Joe. Pursuit of Cobra and not yes. cancel it from the G.I. Joe movies because yeah. those were the sickest looking figures. Those were amazing. And yeah. they oh. barely lasted a year. Dude, yeah. well, we had a bunch of those two packs on order, and they were like, hey, never mind. Is there exclusive Toys R Us and Big Bad Toy Store? So Toys R Us. This is why you're, you're failing. The toys. <laughs> this is why you're failing because you don't want to sell your toys. Yeah. They sat at my toys. Or maybe they should do like yeah. Metal and Digital River. Stuff. Just have well, adults yeah, buy it online. There's no cartoon. Except sell it to toy Broadway. stores as well. Yes. Take that Digital River. Me too, Super take Seven. That. And nostalgia can only take you so far. You got to make a. Exactly. If, if you're gonna if you're gonna cater to the 25 to 40 year old you know, a uh, high-end adult toy collector. You need to make a premium product. High end. So if you're going to make a... But if Build make a flag. It, if you're going to make it for kids, and then there needs animals. to be a company. That's a great you know, idea. You've got to be like Nickelodeon. <laughs> you know, you need to have that Ninja Turtles online. You know, you exactly. need to have a... So, you know, Nickelodeon, Ninja Turtles, they've got it right. They figured out They figured out how to... You know, there's an adult end of the spectrum for Turtles, and there's a kid end of the spectrum. I think people just like Turtles ways. in general. Yeah, so that's great, of. but... Well, I think... I think G.I. Joe yeah. should be a more powerful franchise than Ninja exactly. Turtles. Exactly. They it have should guns. Be. Well, I don't know if it should be more powerful, but it should be... G.I. Joe is, like, to me, on the same level as, like, a Ninja Turtles or, let's say, like, a Batman... Or They're the Marvel. first action figure. But Ninja Turtles has exceeded them, though. But I'm just saying, GI Joe should always be on TV. There should always be a GI Joe cartoon. I agree. Um, They've mishandled the license. Because I mean, like, okay, so I, I was a little Bring too young Savage. for these to grab my attention. Okay, don't like, get extreme. GI Joe extreme. Well, I'm actually <laughs> gonna say that. No, I'm gonna say no. I had all of the GI Joe toys. That's what you grew up with. Because that's the GI Joe that was on when I was a kid. And even though that cartoon was terrible. A child, I see that. I'm like, oh, that's the thing that's on TV. I want that. Can you reenact some of the dialogue, or do you remember the show? Just like, bro, you didn't do the, shoot up and fight Cobra, bro. Shoot up, fight Cobra. <laughs> <laughs> so extreme. It's not. So they weren't all natural. <laughs> no, dude, it's the '90s. Everybody's all Hogan juice. Is that true, Jessica? <laughs> Tell us about the. Probably so. Okay. <laughs> Let's talk about Rob's toys. 
Uh, you didn't even pick any toys to talk about. That's just what you're gonna buy, right? No, man, These are here for a limited yeah. time in the next 15 minutes. Ron yeah, just used the podcast as an excuse to come in and shop early. <laughs> no, I do not. Hey guys, uh, I heard you just got the Leonardo. I just grabbed a bunch of Loose Here's Legends. Uh, that's my favorite thing to go through. Like, I'll spend a lot of time over there. Why don't you hold them up a little higher? Why don't you move your box, Andy? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Rob so is very of, sleepy this morning. There's a lot of good Toy Biz ones. Cannonball there. No new stuff X Nilo from the New Guardians wave. But then there's also some cool ones that I saw. Like the two pack. These last two weren't cool. <laughs> <laughs> no, but like the two pack Mandarin and uh, first appearance hey, Wolverine. You're welcome. Cat, I could have passed on those, but I took those the time cool. to go through that collection. And then a sweet Toy Biz uh, Luke Cage. Very cool. Dude. Lucas. Yeah. Ah, Lucas. And, cool and then Luke I kind of wanted to talk about something you had. Too. Yeah, that's fun. sick. Right y'all, can, y'all can talk about it together. Okay. We're the tag team, dude. What was our uh, tag team name? Already quick, forgot. quick uh, shout out to. Great Quick Randy. shout out to uh, Fidel for the uh, successful one. Wonderful YouTube uh, yeah, video review. Yeah, 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 man. Yeah, yeah, a lot of make viewers lot, on that, man. No, Thank you. So appreciate it, man. <laughs> Should still be on our uh, on our Facebook page, yeah. right? Yeah. So yeah. Go check that out. I didn't eat. Like, I had a post ready, and I was like, man, I'm going to let I'm gonna let that circulate for another two hours. So I scheduled it to like air uh, later on that day. Smart. And if you want to visit Fidel at his house, go to. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Send him turtles in the mail. Love yeah. letters. Here's a list of his fears. That was a great review. <laughs> <laughs> and thanks I, for the I show. I watched it. <laughs> well, he's done all the quarter scale turtle reviews. Yeah, it's awesome. It's a quarter scale guy. But not even, just those figures are so freaking awesome. But. Seriously, we've, we've gushed on this toy line so much on it's this, awesome, dude. Yeah, on this it's show. It's awesome. On this page. And. It is just incredible. I personally have not had a chance to open one of these up and take a look at it, uh, you know, myself. But um, just looking at it through the box, you know, the sculpt, as always, is just on point. Accessories, just through the bus. The katanas, especially, mm. are not radical. fabulous. <laughs> fabulous. Talk about money and getting the toy I mean, for your this money. Toy, this toy is jawsome. I'll say that. It's, jawsome. A, it's the best value per oh, ounce oh, of yeah. toy. Why are you using oh, yeah. these terms? Like, <laughs> you know, Street Shark ain't supposed to. <laughs> Dude, I love Ninja Turtles, but in a straight up fight, I'm pretty sure the Street Sharks would win. Like, they I think so. They just eat, eat them. What? I don't know. They man. eat them. They, they went against Bebop, Rocksteady, yeah. Toka, and Razor. Hold on. Hey, dude, we got You're both wrong. Girl. Extreme dinosaurs. Yeah. They take it all the way. <laughs> I think Toxic Crusade. I don't think a shark is standing against a dinosaur. Stormtroopers. Stormtroopers. I'm throwing in biker mice from Mars into the mix. Oh, They'll just God. run over oh, the competition. Fuck you, oh, hey. Attitude era, NWO. He's got spaceships. Yeah. <laughs> the show's gone off the rails. <laughs> what about, yeah. I'm throwing that in. Yeah, what about the Battle Toads? We've got the Battle Toads. Anyone named after a pimple or a sit, there's a chance. Yeah, sit, pimple, rash. Zit, and something. I forget the last one. Blackhead, I don't know. <laughs> the, the toast? Yeah. Zash, uh, Zash. Yeah, yeah, Rash, yeah, zits, and pimple. There you go. See? I was right. Zits and pimple. Rash, zits, and pimple. But Rob, would you like to say anything about this story? So right? rad. It's, it's awesome. It's awesome. Come buy them. Come buy them. That's so cool. Like, how we did not? get a substantial quantity of this toy, but they are flying. Limited so supply. We, we, we don't we got, have an abundance. We got three people uh, right here on the table that are buying them today. Isn't it so yeah. three yeah. years? Yeah. heard the Donny gone too? Yeah. Donny yeah. sold. How many times has Donny been sold out? Pedro will be here to pick up his. Three. Well, each time a new turtle comes out. Just kidding. Supposedly real work. That's so cool. But I, uh, I mean, it's if I had to put money on it, I would say they'll be gone today. <laughs> like, I mm, I'd say Saturday. Think so? Saturday. They'll, they'll be here till Saturday. They, really, they need to release out. a splinter. Yes. No, they yeah. need to release yeah. Shredder. No, they yeah. need to do a Shredder Bebop and Rock. Shredder would be cool. Dude. They should release a Danny. Oh, yeah, you're right. Danny. I was thinking Danny. The first Ninja Turtles. Can he hit? Why? Fully articulated with a $20 bill in his pocket. I want a quarter scale Kino. Yeah, I'd really have Kino. I want Kino with his... <laughs> they should sell the accessory packs. And he needs to make, like, needs uh, to make fat jokes about it. Like <laughs> I was just saying, he'll say really mean uh, things. Do you think they would do like hair like a human figure or flock? The main guy that April's yelling at. They'd sculpt it. They'd sculpt it. Yeah, they might do the hair on the face or something. Yeah. Yeah. All right, do we have some time for some questions? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Or yes. Yes. We have, we'll start we have, talking we have about Andy's stuff. We have a ton of questions. I've been promising people that they can answer the questions. So let's pull that Nash out at least. I'm going to... Gary, I'm going to go through what I put on the table just real quick. Oh, whoops. No, no, you're fine. Uh, we got some really cool McFarlane uh, Halo action figures. 
Uh, Hello. Those are prices to sell, and also we we're always getting on some uh, WWE Elite yeah. toys. Yeah, got the wonderful. ringside exclusive Kevin Nash, big sexy with the oh. spray yeah. spray can. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that thing's so Intercontinental awesome. Intercontinental Champion version of the Ultimate Warrior. How many Ultimate Warriors is Mattel gonna release? Oh, Man. I don't know. Think One of the I went. I went into a Walmart yesterday, and I counted five currently on the shelf. If you I count basics it. and elites, wow. and that's like the exact same toy, different face paint. You're not, you're not gonna oh, and also. Uh, Quentin Tarantino, famed, right famed here. Uh, director, mm-hmm. only director toy in the building. Yes. That's All awesome. right. Which let's, let's, let's get, get those, those comments and questions. Oh, let's read out that it. hate mail. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey! I never knows what his, his little T-shirt. Okay. That's graphic. Yeah. <clears throat> What's to say? It's good. It's What's gonna to say? Like a, it's gonna uh, <laughs> top so the So Tim, on. Tim says I need some <laughs> new Rossi figures in my life. Me too. Rocky, right here. We got some. And Tim says or. Maybe that Fireball Island. Hey, no, hey, it's complete. I'll get it. Uh, Juan says, <laughs> greetings from Mexico. Hola. Que paso? Saludo. Hello. You put, that, you put that J in there and everything. Well, that's because they put the little line over the E. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so oh you got to make sure it's pronounced. The yeah, translator. Uh, Casey says, is there demand for a G.I. Joe 25th anniversary figures happening? There is here. <laughs> I'd, I'd love to uh, bring them in. Would buy There's a buzz around this table, and it's mostly. We actually got a bunch forever. of those in. <laughs> oh, yeah. Buzz around oh, yeah. the table. We had. Beans I think we got about seventy of those in. <laughs> yeah. Office. Nice. I'm excited. Uh, Shavera Sh- says, "Sup, guys." Sup. So. What up? Hi. Uh, Amanda says, "The San Diego Comic Con Twin Peaks Coop and Laura Palmer possess pop toy. Hmm. Gonna get that. Are you? Yes, we are. Are you? <laughs> nice. I was like, Amanda, wait a second, toys. What pop was it? Twin Peaks. Yeah, Twin Peaks. What pop was it in here? The Twin Peaks. Uh, Bobby yeah, Ruth says, I wish I was there, but I'm at I wish you were too. Bobby? Bobby. Say Bobby Rude? Ruth. Bobby Ruth. Bobby Ruth. Oh, I think it's Bobby Ruth. Come check Bobby out Ruth. the X Plus Bioland The sweetest yeah, bro, uh, Deadshot cosplay. Shout out. Joe Snoop says, sweet. Vintage Captain Action. Captain, Captain Action. Action. Uh, I don't think we have any of that in stock right now. I wonder if uh, I can make room. Usually when 64 judges come in. Yeah, Batroid and Dynaman. Who? Herbert says Batoid, Batroid and Dynaman. And there's more. Never heard of them. Always more. John says you guys have the best store on the planet. Thanks, man. Woo! Thanks. Thanks. That's John. On the planet. On the planet. That's John. Our universe. Sir, Sir <laughs> There's that one on Pluto, dude. Uh, Selena says, do y'all have a <laughs> There's a guy that messaged me or left what's, a comment on the page yesterday. The and he's like, I'm only a 21-hour drive down from Canada. No, Bog Leonardo. What's yeah. your favorite toy that's on the table what's that today? Plant? This one's mine. Biolante! What is that? Ah, that's that's my favorite toy that's on the table Henry today. Henry found that growing in the warehouse. No, I found this in uh, <laughs> Ryan's <laughs> backyard, man. We named it Carl. Dude, you should put that in a planner. <laughs> That's nice. Carl needs some chocolate. Ryan pudding. was like, "Hey, I'm bringing this in." So like, I instantly made the room for it on top of one of the glass cases. And I was like, "Dude, like, well, what are you I waiting s- on? Bring it." I Dude. said I might bring it by, and then Henry goes, "Okay, hold on," and then makes space for it. And I'm like, <laughs> "I guess I'll bring it by." <laughs> I was like, "You're selling it now." I mean, <laughs> feed me, Seymour. That thing is so sick. Yeah, Which uh, movie is this one from? It's from Godzilla vs. Biollante, 1989. <laughs> I was going to say, this is the Death Star Trash Monster, the yeah, 9 I know. <laughs> Look, get out of the trash compactor! <laughs> it's a full view of the Sarlacc pit. Yeah, dude. Dark it's gorgeous. It's absolutely it's, cool. I mean, Sarlacc, baby. Amazing. She, yeah. she is she, a beaut. Yeah. It's a she. I saw uh, you posted some pictures right. of the, uh, the Rick and Morty toys. With yeah. yeah. It's hilarious. <laughs> like, Herbert yeah. says, there should be a G.I. Joe cartoon, possibly a better remake than Renegades, which makes them... Like the A-Team. My kids love the toys, but there's no proper shows for it. Mm, not one. Agreed. We're living in such there's a good one. age of animation. It's like, you know... Why isn't there a Turtles show? cartoon that's on today, it's better than the Vintage Ninja Turtle cartoon. Mm-hmm. Like, uh... The most most, uh, <laughs> most uh most uh, Marvel it things that are online you know, are better than the stuff no, it used to be. Like, the new Voltron is pretty awesome. The new Voltron I mean, kicks yeah. the old Voltron's exactly. butt. Like, it's so much better. So yeah. I need to get into it. It's great. <laughs> Sean's face is turning red. <laughs> I can't get past two episodes of the new one. Of oh, the new Ninja Turtles? I like the no, Voltron. Ninja. Oh yeah. Oh. Bobby says I'm gonna have to cop that Leonardo eventually. Yeah, better be quick. Eventually, and you might you might have to wait till September if you wait any longer. They do, they they do go quick. Uh, Almost got to do a spit take. take. <laughs> yeah, agreed on all three of those. Sure. John Paul says, "Is it true that you guys are going to move into a Starbucks?" 
Yes. Um, that'd be nice. Yes. I don't know so, that you guys are putting in Starbucks here. And then we're going to kick Starbucks. I would like to. No, I would <laughs> like to. Just throw those cardboard things in some cups. Yeah. Pour your own. <laughs> then Danny toys are just like, Don't leave the go spill. <laughs> Danny says that Yoda is saying, buy more toys, you must spend all your money, you will. All of it. Dude, I like Yoda's. Yeah, I, I like Yoda Yoda's saying. Whoa, the mouth is articulated. I do. It's terrible. Yeah, <laughs> oh, yeah same here. <laughs> <man. laughs> look, look at the twinkle Ooh, in his eye. He's like, oh, I wish you will. It's like, <laughs> money Miguel on Miguel said, this line. I wish I could buy that Leonardo TMNT on your website. Yeah, unfortunately, because yeah. of the size and uh, weight, um, all pro all, um, we can't do free shipping. That's yeah. a beefy and Bobby thing. says, "Holy s, bio lante." <laughs> we told you. Yeah, I knew you like it, Bobby. <laughs> it exists. Holy, Holy s, skittles. Uh, Holy skittles. Take like that mouth, Henry. Says, "What is if you had to pick one toy line to collect, what would it be?" Boglins. I, I think we all know what mine would be. Boglins. Boglins. What? S H Monster Arts Godzilla. Mine would be figure arts. Don't you oh, have no, them? No, that's a broad topic, though. Yeah. About those yeah. No, not yeah. anymore. <laughs> and the Beanie Babies. Yeah. Beanie Babies that when you squeeze out, Funko they puke out Funko Pops. Yes. <laughs> I would buy that. Dude. And their hands shoot out Pogs. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Sign me up. Yes. That was brilliant. <laughs> Triple changer. You're What's your make, favorite toy line, I, Sean? I'd like to see Money. the t-shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Sean's like, I, I would like story. to collect <laughs> coin. If I could collect one series, it'd be the greenbacks. <laughs> so I can buy more toys. <laughs> Thank, thank you, Mr. These Krabs. Uh, Rob, Mr. Krabs. I'm the collection. <laughs> Rob, what would be your, your toy line that you'd like? <laughs> My favorite? Uh, NECA, just NECA in general. <laughs> NECA in general. Uh, I told you I'm trying to finish my Predators this nice. year. Like, get every but, single one. What are you going to say if, it, if, it, if, if NECA is a Star Wars, right? If I had to be more yeah. specific, yeah. Yeah. it would be NECA for a scale. Well, but then you have to throw these wrenches in. Because that's just that's a toy line you walk in to a house and you're like, oh, instantly. You can't control what comes in there. I know. They made toys this big. Yeah. You're like, look at all I brought all these in that real big one. I can't find. Yeah. Anything else, Jared? The halls have been insane. I got a question for you guys. Too. What's that? Do you guys collect Ninja Turtles? Like from back in the day? Like did you guys ever like have? Yes, sir. What was your yeah. favorite? What was your favorite figure out of the whole? Casey line? Jones, the Turtle Wagon. The Turtle Wagon. I was gonna say, I could put dude. The, the Van. Yeah, because I could gotta, put any other toy. Let, let me do that. Let Donatello. Okay. He had the most reach in the video game. <laughs> Undercover yeah. Don. Undercover Under, Don. Yeah. Undercover Don. Like Dude, I really I like the... the my friend's younger brother. Rob's was, was that racist. Was younger, so. um, Bandito Mikey. <laughs> Bandito <laughs> Bashing Mikey. Bandito <laughs> Bashing Mikey. <laughs> 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 I grew up on that. That'd be hilarious. Give me a quarter cool skull. Did you have the original Mondo Gecko or the like hippie Kring? one, the second one? No, I like the trash dude a lot. Okay. Yeah. I had the hippie one where he had like the guitar that turned cool. into a scooter. And yeah, he was wearing like braids. Dude, I like the transformation turtles. I like the 1991 Desert Storm Turtles with that Oh yeah, those yeah, are really yeah. cool. With the helmet, with the helmet yes. and everything. Did you guys so like the mutation turtles? The ones that came in the big yeah. box? Yeah. Like, I was like, about yeah. that, man, because I like Transformers. So you're yeah. going to put Transformers and Turtles in there? But the Transformers are really like, cool, I got like, a baby cool. turtle. Hey, thanks yeah, for yeah, ripping off our idea. Like, <laughs> we need money. 1993 was like late. Yes. It was yeah. crazy. Like fire emojis like all around. Like, <laughs> yeah, nineties GI Joes were lit. They were like with their neon. Oh, that's extreme. Hot pink hey, rifles. Some, some of us like that. Yeah. That's happening. <laughs> I know, right? Like, no one talks about Sergeant Savage in this whole. I think this was like the best line, and then it kind of started going like maybe no, so much better. Was that eighty eight or better than the extreme? See, ninety one, ninety two is where it got real. Way better. Eighty nine, ninety, they still made some good ones, but then it started getting kind of. I want the whole Eco Warriors line. It's so good. Save the planet. Save the planet. Just one. Save the planet. Have that work out for you. Um. Uh, did they make any battle damage turtles like the old He-Man ones? No. Ah, uh, yeah, it's called you played with them and... <laughs> it's called get a Sharpie, go to town. They did make battle damage uh, Jurassic Park, though. Did they? Oh, yeah, yeah. remember? Dino yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you chomp damage. Them off. Oh, yeah. Dino damage. Dino damage. Yeah, in 93, they had this great yeah. feature yeah. where every dino, you could pull a chunk off of it yeah. and reveal its rib cage and exposed muscles. And it was yeah. just a oh, T-bone. Yeah. And then so this tear would roll down the cheek. He's like, oh, that hurts. <laughs> every every like, piece of meat looks like a T-bone. I had the stick of Yeah, Ian's like, I'm hungry. I need a dino stick. Go up uh, on the high hide. What's terrible about that first note for a toy is you know that dinosaur? He's never going to win. Jeremy fight says, I can't, can't believe lose, you so have obviously. those boxed boglins. <laughs> yes! 
Believe it. Yes! We're gonna make a boggling t shirt now. Or a pen. We should really document that before we sell them. That's, that's exceedingly rare. <laughs> that bites. <bite. laughs> now there's it, only one. Then it bites you. <laughs> Man, <laughs> Drop them off so, elbow. So, so I think Henry's first instinct yeah. was to put his hand in the little puppet. I want to. I I moved around the eyes. Wouldn't like, you? I'm it's kind of than, it's better than what I'm he not did with stick the. My hand up and something. It's better than what Rob did with the humanoids and like there's like first at the bubble or whatever. You on did it, and then, and then like ten minutes later, Jared did it, and Jared was like, "What the?" Great lines. <laughs> Henry was dancing around with that. Uh, that uh, yeah, that feels like oh yeah, drink for me. I got like just Bobby asks, or whatever it was. Gigan, the, the Gigan Gigan, Gigan, and it still is. Gigan, it's win for you, buddy. It's win for you. I might get the Final Wars Godzilla too, depending on the money. Do it, bro. Well, hopefully the money's right, and you get both of them. Do it. Come Sunday, you don't need to pay your rent. Hang out. Toys. You're worth right now. Earning that money. Godzilla money. What's that? X plus is life. Mm-hmm. Those are the figures he's talking about. This is life. Nice. It's life. Just to give you guys a little quick update on our video's performance today. Today's video has already been viewed 2,000 times and has reached 6,700. Trial and error. God. <laughs> thousands and thousands around record. the world. <laughs> Ignored <laughs> our notification. <laughs> they say there's too many of us. I say rubbish. It's all because of you, man. <laughs> We need to have like a whole crowd going like back here, man. Be, be, be live studio audience. You now a question from our live studio there. audience. <laughs> yeah. Be dope. Come a long way. Come a long way from the old dance <laughs> office. For sure. Yes. Was that what it was? Was it a dance? We used to x ray the toys to make them mutate <laughs> was and it? grow. Very in addition. Yeah, that's an how office. we got bombed. I didn't know that was a dentist's office, though. It's just, yeah, it's an office, man. It, yeah, it's I know it was an office. It's got much to learn, young buck. Man, I remember whenever I first came in there, that was the greatest thing ever. I was like, whoa. <laughs> dentist's office. Yeah, yeah people well, would come up in the first I'm gonna room. I'm going to get my teeth cleaned. Like, I was just like, turned. man, I just want to get my teeth cleaned, and you guys all have all these toys. I was like, okay, I guess I'll collect That was really cool. You had to go into this old creepy building, go up an elevator, try not to. Yeah, Try not to get kidnapped. They locked door, <laughs> yeah. they open the locked door, and there's no toys on the other side. Yeah, I got and you're it. like, what? And then you go around the corner, and it's like, ba bam! Right in the face with toys. And that's what we did. We punched level. you in the face and said, ba bam! Welcome, bam! <laughs> I got off on the wrong level the first time, and I was like, oh, okay, I guess it's not here. <laughs> and then some. Then Fidel went home. <laughs> yeah. Pedro took me the next time. I was like, oh, we okay, need to cool. install like a bookcase or something here in the entrance where people walk in. There's supposed to be a bookcase. Like a speakeasy yeah. of sorts, but yeah, for toys. Like pull, yeah. <laughs> I remember the first time I tried to go to the location, I had GPS took me to where it was, and I pulled up and saw it was an office building, and I was like, there's no toy stores here, and I left. And then I got on Facebook. That's and impossible! I, I'm appalled. And then I got home, and I messaged. <laughs> Andy did a drive-by. I messaged Sean, and, uh, or messaged the store, and someone said, yeah, you'll go up to the sixth floor. And I was like, okay. And then I went back, and I was pretty sure I'm going to get murdered. Like, I'm gonna go up here to look at toys and someone's gonna get murdered for some toys. <laughs> but I remember it was it was <laughs> during um, it was during Black Friday weekend, one of the first year I moved here, and you guys were having like a, a tub sale out in the hallway. Uh, me, and my, me and my wife, yeah. wa- like wa- me and my wife, walk, uh, me and my wife, me and my wife, walk, 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 walk. I just had a stroke. Apologies. <laughs> uh, but um, we're having me and my me and my wife, we walked up and we see all these tubs, and we dug through those tubs for probably an hour. And we had to spray them so with water. In, and so we, I walked into awesome. the actual store to pay for that stuff, and then realized, oh my god, there's an entire store here too. And then we were there for probably another hour. Like, we just throw stuff in the hall. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Those were the days. Man. I love he was themselves. looking for deals. She was looking was for a man that doesn't like toys. Yeah, she didn't find. She didn't find one. Yeah. No. Just for an hour, that tub. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there's a man who won't take me to a toy store in here. That didn't work out uh, well for I, me. But uh, that's why I'm going to petition today that we build a hedge mage, he, hedge maze in front of the store so people get that same experience. All in favor, say aye. 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 Oh, people already have a <laughs> difficult time finding Yeah, it's hard enough as it is, man. <laughs> well, no, we need a hedge maze. We had to make, we had <laughs> to make Jared so make a YouTube video on how to get here. I don't yeah. think it needs what? to get any harder. We had to have Jared make the YouTube video oh, on how to get here. I don't think it needs to get any harder. I was like, what? <laughs> Someone in that chat room came in. I already hear enough people like, I had a hard time finding it. I was like, hey, me too. The people from Belgium found us. Hey, Super man. easy. That's I mean, Europeans from... are really smart. 
Man. Last Ooh. weekend, this lady was like, Hard "They really are. I stay in business over here. They I have excellent you. navigation like, We skills. wonder that every day. We do <laughs> successfully. I guess. We throw toys <laughs> out in the parkway, and people find us. Yeah, yeah, so we take donations. Please help. We go out to, <laughs> go out to <laughs> Horace Lane. Follow us on Patreon. <laughs> this yeah. is not a museum. Patreon. Go fund me for the. It's our Patreon that keeps us in business. Okay, so last last few questions here. We got an early start today. It's uh, just now ten o'clock, but it seems like all of our customers are already in the store. Seriously, I think we uh, Rob shut I think down. We started earlier. My butt's mm-hmm. starting to hurt. I said Rob shut down. I'm out of drink, dude. I need to go get a drink. Rob required more red bull. I think he's falling asleep. I, I, I called. Dude, I got so chair. comfy in this chair. <laughs> Wait, how do I? So Bobby says you guys are gonna I make me go dude. broke in a good way. That's a that's the, LOL. That's the, that's that's the goal, man. That's what we do. We aim to put everyone in poverty. In a good way, though. The best thing is <laughs> being hungry. With in the best figure. way. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I hate being broke the you bad start way. Petting the yeah. Hungry Leonardo. It's like, hey, you're homeless, but you got this sick. Like, man, you got this guy. Turtle leg looks good. You got this guy gigging. <laughs> you might be starving, but the you got that toy you wanted. Gigging, gigging. Yeah. All your favorite hot toys. Right. Um, Stop petting the toy. And Eric Allen says, <laughs> "Yo, yo, Joe." Hi. Follow these comments. We're gonna work on these. We're gonna do it. Okay, work on that. All right, well, there's the first one called. All right, Sean. Tell me about could, that. Really not so kind is to tell uh, our live viewers and friends watching on replay where they can find us online or in person. We are open Tuesday through Saturday, 10 to 6, Sunday, 11 to 6. Check us out online at DallasFinishToys.com. Like, subscribe to us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter. Our address is 120524 Skate Drive, Dallas, Texas, 75243. We buy, sell, and trade toys. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. From all of us here at Dallas Finish Toys, we'll see you live next Wednesday morning and uh, hopefully here in the store soon. Have a great day. Aww.